All right, everyone, welcome to 838 Minecraft 4 stream. 8. It's hard to believe we're already at 8. We barely just started this thing. But, uh, yeah. We're already at 8. So, how is everyone doing today? And welcome. Hmm? What's going on? So, we've got a few missions today. A few things I want to work on. A couple of which <clears throat> uh, I, I came up with yesterday. Literally yesterday. I, I don't know if anybody's ever done these before, but I literally came up with this idea. And I was... You know, I really... I'm kind of lazy about this kind of stuff, so I just did easy, make it work in extremely easy fashion. With a couple of things. <clears throat> Tinkered around a little... And, uh, I'm gonna build them today. I'm gonna attempt to today. I should... Okay. Uh, because I've only done them once, so we'll see where... Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so... Yesterday, Mike and I were, in fact, talking about these things right here okay and we were talking about how when you put them on there you gotta come up there and you gotta you gotta harvest them you gotta go like this okay and then you get like the three of them okay and that's that's how you harvest them and i said well i don't believe there's a way to auto harvest these things well i came up with a way to auto harvest these things I don't know what you're thinking. How? How does he do it? What? What do you mean, auto harvest? Well, you'll see. We need to get everything set up first. So, first things first. Do I have a shovel on me? Yes, I. Do. Oh, I can't dig here. There's nothing underneath of this to dig under to. This means we're going to have to put it somewhere else where we know that there's a solid foundation underneath it. Uh, we could put it somewhere over here and then put the... Uh, what's going on over here? Not much. I could put the scaffolds here. Going straight down, which will get us to the box. And then we could go from there. We can make this happen. Yeah, I think this will work. Okay. So we go, like, from here... That'll do it. We put the scaffold right there. We can go straight down. We put the box where we need it to. We got this. Okay. I need to make what we need for this. How many pieces of wood do we have? We're gonna need some logs or something. It's dirt. We will need a little bit of stone. We're gonna need a wee bit of wood. Oh, we, we might have enough here. There's 40 in here, right? Yeah, yeah. No, not that. That's really weird, by the way, that snowballs don't melt in a block, in a box like that. They really should melt. We're gonna need 
more of these. What do we got for boxes? I'm gonna need. We're gonna need about that many, yeah. Okay, now we need iron, which I highly doubt this is going to be enough for, but we'll see. Oh, it's an exact amount. Okay. I need... What do I need to make... I need a sticky piston. What do I need for a piston? We're gonna need, we're actually gonna need several sticky pistons today. But uh we need iron, stone wood, and redstone. We're gonna need to make more wood and we're gonna need to get some redstone. You can go here. Did I have any more stone? I did. Okay, we're gonna. We might need a few more. We're gonna need more redstone for sure. Well, not we. I I think we'll be okay with redstone. I think. I think so. Oh, did I have enough? For okay, now what do I need for piston? I need. Oh, you just make they just make this a little difficult to find, don't they? Piston, piston, pistons. Even, am I even in the area we'd find pistons? Yeah, there it is. I have. Oh, I don't have the logs. Okay. Okay, now what can I do for pistons? I know what I'm gonna need for t for this whole thing. We're gonna do one, two, three pistons. No, we might need more. We might need more if we're gonna do this correctly. Let's make. Okay, so if I did. feeling we're not yeah I have a feeling we're not set for well whatever else I needed to we're, we're gonna be a little short on a few things I might have to make more later Now we need actual chests. We need actual chests. That's We're gonna need yeah, for all of the builds we have planned for today, we're gonna need a few things. So we're gonna need actual chests for this. Keeping that. Mm. 
Okay. Uh, there. I ran out of boxes. Okay, we're gonna need to make more. Let's go uh, make more. I probably won't need this many hoppers, but we'll see. I'd rather have them and be over, overdone. You know? Yeah. We're gonna do it. We'll we'll do all of them because, yeah. I need switches. I need to figure out what I need to make a switch. Um, levers. Uh, we will need three. I think four. We will need. F you know what? We'll just make. We're just gonna make five levers. We're not going to need this much. How do I make a sticky piston? Oh, uh, yeah. Sticky piston. We need... We can do that. We got the slime. Where is the slime? Okay, so we're gonna need a little bit of a bamboo and a little bit of that. And we're done, so we're gonna take that with us. We're gonna need a few other things too. We're gonna bring this with us, and I suppose that can come with us. There's the slime. Right there. Okay, and I need. Okay, we need, we're going to need a fair amount of sticky pistons. I'm going to need to get some more, we're out of pistons, I need more pistons. Um, okay, I have the redstone, I have the stone, I don't have the logs again. Always about the logs, always. Okay, now we need... We can make ten more pistons. All right, now we need to do the sticky pistons. Again, I probably don't need this many, but I'm gonna do it anyway, just just to have extra. Okay. Oh, well, we should go to sleep. Okay, so one of the things we're going to do will require this stuff too, so we're going to need a few of these. What I might do is base it off of this specifically. I'm probably going to build it here specifically, so that way I can just drop it wherever I need it. But we'll deal with that in a second. Okay, so. If 
first things first, we need things to measure up with, okay? So we need this stuff right here. Of course you fell down. We're going to go down there and grab that in a second. Because I need jungle wood. No, you don't. Don't you come over here. Don't do it. You did this to yourself. Don't put this on me. Okay. Now we have our... We don't need this. Honestly, I don't I don't know why I'm still carrying that. So, we're going to put the box somewhere over here and then we'll base it off of that. I don't have any boxes. <laughs> I used them all. I didn't I didn't keep any boxes. Look, we, we don't need to talk about it, people. We don't need to talk about it. We're going to need more boxes than that. It'll work for now. Do we have any other wood in here? I hope so. I really want to have to go get more. I planned this amazing build and then I don't have any logs. Such is life though, you know? You know? You know? You know? We're gonna need... I think that should do it. Yeah, we should need that. But... We're out of stone, aren't we? No, there, there was stone inside. And that should be enough for what we need. We shouldn't need any of that. We will need this. Alright, let's do this. Let's let's freaking do this. We're gonna We're gonna rock this thing. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna rock this thing. I'm going to have to dig down underneath of this. I put it in the wrong spot. This is where it's at, right there, I believe. Yeah, that's where it is, right there. So, we're out. That'll work. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, we need to do... Yeah. 
course, we're gonna have to dig out this wall, too. I can't very well have that be the wall if we're gonna be basing it off of this, you know? I can't. Um, you know what? We're good. We could uh, just do. That. Yeah, we could. We can fill the wall back in. That's fine. I thought it was a little further over than it was. Again, I've only done this one time, people, so you're just going to have to bear with me. I'm, I'm, I'm literally doing this. This will be the second time I've even attempted to do this. Not gonna have enough stone. Okay, we want to put our chests down. I think we'll put our chests here. Yeah, that works. Uh, we're gonna need to expand it out one more. Yep, we're gonna need to get more stone. Eh, well, we don't need to go this far out. I mean, you know, that'll work. Ah, man. This is going to be annoying. I'm going to have to stop what I'm doing and go get more stone. Ugh really didn't want to do that. Yep, we're already out. We're already out of stone. <clears throat> I want to call shenanigans, but I just can't. Alright, let's go to the mine. Go get some more stone. Again, at some point, I'm actually going to do one of those how-to videos. How to build all of this stuff. I want to make ha like a little thing of it, and I'll do uh, little highlights for my Twitch specifically for people who want to learn how to make this stuff. And again, I don't know if I'm the first person to do them or not. I don't really look this stuff up. I literally just go, okay, what is it I want to do, and go from there. So, yeah, there's a good chance somebody else did all this before me, but I don't actually know. So. have torches on us, I think, right? Yeah, we do. I hear... There's, like, something around here. What do I have? It's... I don't know. We might have enough stone for the project we're doing, but... 
I don't know. Will it be worth it? We'll see. It's gonna have to be enough, because that's all I've got. Okay. For now, we're going to do it like this. At least until I can get the uh, stuff set up here. Okay, what's this? I think it's right here, right? No, it's right here. This is the one. We're going to go to sleep for a second. <sighs> Boy, if we just didn't have to sleep, this whole thing would be so much faster. Not the time, okay? Come on. That's just rude. No, I don't think I need this one right here. Which I don't have a pickaxe. Off the top. Let's go make another pickaxe. Ugh. Do I have enough to make a pickaxe? I really hope I. I don't have enough to make a pickaxe. What is it I need? I don't have any logs or something I'm going to Yeah. I don't have any logs. I don't have any sticks, so I need to make sticks. Do I have enough to make a pickaxe now? Yes. We gotta save the rest of my iron. I'm gonna need it just in case I need to make another pickaxe. I don't need that. Everything we don't need, I don't want to have on me. Great, okay, now we're we're good. I don't think we need this one. I think we're gonna keep this one, but we don't need that one. <sighs> yep, that was done wrong as well. Yep, these were both done wrong. Okay.
You went into the wall, didn't you? Yes, you did. Now, this is where what we're going to do is going to come in handy. I need to go... You gotta go. No, well, no, nah, you can stay. You can stay. We're good. This will all be uh, worth it if, I, if this works out like I think it will, because this has all been planned out prior to in my head, which doesn't always work and <laughs> does, does not all. So yeah, you guys are just going to see where it takes us, because I've been, I've only done this once early. <sighs> Did I bring... Oh, no! No, 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 I didn't. Tell me I didn't. I did. Oh, no. I can't finish this right now. I have to go get more jungle wood. I, I messed up. I messed up bad. I messed up bad. Whoa, whoa. I hear noises. Crazy noises. Yeah, I'm not surprised that that happened. I was pretty much already... Dead. <laughs> but I need the jungle wood, so we gotta go back. It's literally a requirement. I have to have jungle wood. jungle wood you'll work This thing's ever so we gotta take a wart. Don't start with me. I hear you I hear you there, drowned. It's a zombie. I don't want that. Get it away from me. Okay. Uh, are you jungle wood? No, you're not jungle wood. We need jungle wood.
I think your jungle would. Yeah, this one should be jungle wood. This may not be jungle wood. <laughs> but here's to hoping. That was, in fact, oak, not jungle wood. Crazy. Why am I not surprised? I'm just generally not surprised. Well, I didn't get everything I wanted, but I think I got what I needed. Okay. <sighs> Let's go set this thing up. Where's the jungle wood? Right there. I need to put this in place as well. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted right there. But I need it to go... We need to fix this up a little bit. This isn't going to work with, like, with it the way it is. Tighten this up a little bit in a second. Gotta get everything right where I want it first. Okay. Won't need that one. 
We won't need that one. We don't need this one. Okay, and now we need to set up this. Okay, if I do this right, I gotta go out. Okay, we should be right where I need it. Uh, let's put you here, like that. And then we're going to put you on here. I messed this up. I... Yeah, I messed it up. <laughs> ah, we can fix it. I got it. We just won't. Problem. As far as this goes, we're going to do this. It'll all make sense. It will, maybe. Okay? Just just stick with me. And if if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. But it should work. Oof. Okay. Now, we need to do this. We'll need this. Why are you not working? Ah! Stop doing that. We work now. Perfect. I really should make it so I don't fall off of it, though. I'll say that. Like, it's going to get really annoying if I keep falling off of this. These, this, these, this doesn't have to be there. All right, I'd like to point, I'm going to point that out right now. This does not have to be there. This part right here. This is only here, so I stop falling on my butt. This part does have to be there. There's a reason for this. And it will all make sense in good time.
Oh, that's the perfect height. Yeah. Oh. You got just... This will work out just fine. You gotta go. You're gonna end up falling off anyway. You're fine. But yes, perfect height. Look at that. Oh, ha, ha. All the way around, all the way up. Perfect. Now we don't need to carry this anymore. We will need... We will need one bucket. Just... <laughs> Just one bucket. We're just about ready. We just about have what we need. And it'll be set up to auto harvest. Now, some of this stuff we don't need, and I'm going to get rid of it right now. Because, honestly, it's it just, just extra. And we don't need the extra. We really don't. So, it's pretty much... We shouldn't need this, too. I think we can get rid of this. And... There. This is your basic design, right there. Okay, so you got your your four bricks plus the one underneath. Okay, it's a basic, simple design. Your and then your lever. Okay, you put the water above the the brick that that's connected to the piston, right? Let's wait till it uh, gets harvestable. I don't want to do it yet. So, give it a second. Once it's daytime and everything's all good and dandy, I'll show you guys exactly what it does. Well, start on the other ones. This is what we want it for. All right, the next ones we were gonna do. Okay, was a series of autoresters for bamboo, for sugarcane. And for berries right here. So several of these berries. And if done correctly, we will never need to replant these berries again. Okay, now we have the berries. We 
we're gonna capitalize. We already got do connecting it to that, but we will do connecting it somewhere else. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go let's go out this way. At least over one, two. We'll go after two. I think I know how we're going to do this. We're going to make it so that it all goes into... That goes underneath the house. All of it. Like the bamboo, all of it. It's all going to go to the same chest. Okay. To get down here. Because I need a plant. This up there. Okay. That's what we want right there. Now we need to get over here. I need to get down this way a little bit so I can do what I need to do. It's going to have to be at least right here. We won't need that one. Or that one. Okay, and next we need to do these guys right here. Uh uh. Nope. 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 Oh, what did I. Okay. I gotta get up to it. Oh, wait, I know exactly what I gotta do. Okay, uh, here, let's go out like this. Actually, we're gonna need to do that anyway, yeah. Because, uh, yeah, with the way I have it planned, it's that's absolutely how it's gonna have to go. Urgh. Will you do it the way I want you to do it? There we go. That's what I want. Right there. That's perfect. Okay, and as far as this goes, that goes back up. And then we're going to need a shovel. Where's my shovel? That'll do it. All right, we can make that. Okay, and we're crouched, so we go like so. we could do another row. We're gonna need more iron if we're gonna do another row though. Yeah, we're gonna need more iron if we're gonna do another row because we've got maybe enough to do one more thing. There we go. We, we won't need to do another row if we do it. Okay, we don't need one at the end. We're going to end up getting rid of that. Wait a second. 
We're missing two. Yep. Hold on, does this one even need to be here? No. This one doesn't even need to be here. I put it on the wrong end. Okay, now we're good. That's fine. And then we're gonna put these two at the end here. These two at the end here. I wanna. Oh man, I'm not liking that I'm using all of this stone that I've already got, but. Eh, we'll do what we gotta do. Okay, I have the. Torches on the wall right there. Okay. We're going to put a torch here. And we put a torch fallen there. Now, if this works out correctly, we just go up, we go over here. We're going to need to go down here. There. And these get to go away now. We don't actually need these anymore. But we will need... Urgh. I really gotta stop falling off of things. I really gotta stop doing that. I hope this goes far, far to get a repeater for this. I don't think so, but we might. Is 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 the thing we may repeat her. Okay, stand up. Nope, we don't need a repeater. Again, I keep falling off of this, so we're going to prep for the fact that I keep falling off. <laughs> no, give me that back. These don't actually need to be here again. They're only here for the express purpose so that I don't fall down. All right, so pretty much how this works is you wait for the, uh, the vines to grow, okay? And they grow all the way down here to the point where they're touching these things, right? You go up there, you hit the lever, it pulls out these bricks all the way over. It'll pop off all of the vines from the second part down, dropping them into these hoppers right here where they will be auto-harvested into the box over there, but leaving the first part of the vines. So they're always there, meaning they will continuously grow and always be there. So all you have to do is go up, hit the lever, drop it in, and it's harvested.
This is almost ready as well, so we can show you how this works in a second. Now we got to do the bamboo in the sugar cane. Urgh. Will you go away? Mobsters. Mobs. Horrible creatures. They're so annoying. Now, here's my idea for this one. I think we're going to do the exact opposite that we just did here. Here. So what we'll do is we'll take the sugar cane or the uh, bamboo. We'll put it down here, right? And then we will turn these into the same exact thing, doing the opposite of what we just did on this side, which is up there is where we would have usually popped off of the thing. We're going to do it down here. So we're going to take out this brick right here. Okay, and then we're going to replace that brick with... i got to do this correctly. Otherwise, it just comes off weird. This. So it's going to be like this. And you're going to put one block on there. And you're gonna dig out here. Will you go away? Well, actually no, we're gonna leave this. We're gonna dig out here. Actually, I think we only need one for this. So yeah, I think we can uh, we can save a bit of uh, save a bit of space on this. Okay, we're gonna need one of them to connect. Yeah, we're gonna need one of them to connect over there. So I need to. Dig. Let's go this one. Okay, so we're going to have to do the bamboo and the sugar cane completely differently. Okay? Like, they're, they're totally differently done than each other. Well, not really. I mean, I guess you could do them pretty much the same way. You just can't guarantee that you're going to get 100% out of it, you know, with, with the thing, so. Okay, so, we take our bamboo, we plant it here, I am not going to have enough stone for this again. We're going to have to go get more stone again. Uh, 
I don't know, I think I might have to redesign this a little bit. Because I'm not going to be able to get redstone. Well, actually I can. Of course. Of course. Okay, so we're going to need to we won't we actually won't need the stuff for that for now. All right, now we need redstone. If I do this right, it should it should do what it's supposed to do automatically. All right, now lever. Ready? There we go. Oh shoot, that's perfect idea. I got a perfect idea. Okay. I know we can do both the sugar cane and the bamboo and it'll work out perfectly. Okay, so we're going to take this out because we won't need this. Okay, we won't need that at all. It's going to be, this is going to work out perfect for what we're dealing with right here. Okay. We're going to need one more hopper. Nope. Two more hoppers for what we're doing. I hope I have enough iron for this. Okay. How much iron do I have? Not enough. And I don't think I have any other hoppers left either. Did I have any other hoppers in here? I hope I left hoppers in here. No, but I do have I do have wood in here. Which is better than I thought. But no hoppers, which is uh, what we're really looking for right now. Uh, I just want to be sure I didn't put any in in any of these and didn't notice. Because that would be fantastic if I had the extra two hoppers for this. Nope. I did not. But I do have chests. I have a, apparently a lot of chests that I didn't even realize were in here. So uh, we wasted a lot of time making chests. Apparently. Uh, waste of time. Just a big honking waste of time. Okay. I'll have to go and get some more iron or something. It's 
see if I can find it. Key part is have to find the iron first. This is the one that had all the chests in it, I think, right? Uh, oh. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna f we gotta find more iron. That's the only way this is gonna work for us to get the other two hoppers out of this. Okay. We're gonna show you how this works now because these are completely ripe and ready to be done. Okay. So watch this. Okay. Harvested all of them in one inside. And is that the lever that I need over there right now? I know. Because I'm going to need to put. Of course, I was shot. Okay, we're gonna clean up. Because I don't want in here anymore. Notice, all of the seeds went into here. Wait, we have a hopper. Ha <laughs> ha. One single hopper, but it'll do. And we have iron right here. I think we have some. We might have to make another. Okay, we're gonna hope that at least just enough. Do I have enough to make one hopper? Just one. I don't know. <laughs> uh, where's hopper at? I don't remember which one is under. Not that one. It's gotta be this one. What do we need? We have enough to make one single hopper. We're gonna be out of iron, but we have enough for one single hopper. Which means I think we have everything to make. Perfect. You see? Perfect. Okay. You gotta go. And then... Where's the sugar cane? Right there. Oh yes, that's right. Sugar cane must be by water. But, again, this is an easy fix. Really, really easy fix. Like we can, we can do this in one go. Where to put those buckets? Sure, that'll work. Why am I carrying a tree? We won't need this right now. We don't need that right now. We actually don't need this right now. We made our hopper, so that's good. Oh, uh, I think we're done with sticky pistons, so we can put those away. Uh, we won't need this. Uh, we will need the levers. We'll probably keep this on us. We'll need this. Alright, 
Now, for this, we're gonna need to dig like that. Oh, darn it. I messed up. Yeah, I messed up. Okay, well, I can fix it. That's what we need to do, right? And I messed up again. That's gotta go. Perfect. That's what we there. Okay. Now we put the water in. We are going to need to do this for a second. Set. I need to do... Where is it? Oh, man. <laughs> Let's put those away. I, I did that. That's That was... Yeah, that's what I needed. I don't know why I put those away. <laughs> to go mine and I'm gonna have to do it when no we're not when I'm not streaming I don't really want to make it a point to go do a, a big mine session finds them I guess. when you have to you have to go like and this is literally the perfect height you could just room right here Yes, I know. I know. I don't have to be this lazy. I could potentially harvest them the correct way. But when I can do it this way, it seems like extra work to do it the other way. There's just an... Alright, but some up here because to have it slapped like eh. We'll go we'll go one taller than this. There. That should be tall enough. All right, now do th which we'll take like this, and same thing as before. We're gonna go like so, all the way down. Well, um, give me that. Once that, we will harvest the sugar cane as well. Let's 
the wall. Not necessarily in front of the sugarcane, but at least around the sugarcane. So we'll put it here. And right. Yeah. There you have it, people. We have auto harvesters. And to test this one out, this looks like it could be good enough to give a solid basis as to how it works. Okay. Ready? Oh, that's the wrong one. <laughs> but it did show that the bamboo one works. <laughs> It clearly didn't get, like, all over here, but, uh, yeah. Of course, zombies are going to show up. Let's see if any bamboo actually got while we're at it. Two. We'll work it out. We have to work on the catching system of the whole thing, but, yeah, once we get it so it all falls in place... I think I might have a plan for that. Uh, let's see. I got a message. Alright, so, now, let's see. We'll, we'll, we'll look at it in a second. Once I go to sleep and come back, wake back up. We'll see if we can make this. Will you get off of my my bamboo, please? If you're gonna die like that. I would really appreciate it. I don't really need your zombie all over my bamboo. Yeah, appreciate it. I think I may need to do a wall right here. We gotta get it so when it falls, it falls directly on these. Like, it has to fall directly on them. Alright, now let's test which... That one... That one was up there. Yeah, we need to go up there for that one. Ah, uh, it worked. Still work. Fan. Oh, wait. That's not a bad idea. Some of the stuff that's falling might be getting caught underneath of here. I think what I need to do is do something like this. Okay, so if I did that, it would force it forward would totally force it forward so that way it's gonna go into the the thing I think we might have a plan there yeah as far as this goes we can throw that in there I put one at the end here, didn't I? Well, there's... Uh, 
Oh, that's another problem. Yeah, that's another problem. We're gonna need to, uh, put something here, too. Well, once we get stone or something now, for now it's gonna have to do. That's part of why it's uh, falling correctly. It's just getting caught right there. We need to go forward. It's like, it's, it's gotta fall forward. Bone meal. And see it's caught. If any berries went in here, absolutely. You're not going to get a bunch of berries every time because it doesn't gr always grow berries, but the berries it does get each time. Okay, so we considered some sort of success. I had a whole. What happened? One of these things. Other sticky pistons. No, these are I mean, this could be designed better, I think. I, I think there's a ways I could do a lot easier than what I've done it. And I, I will probably look and see if there's, like, a in the future. Oh my god. Hoppers in here. I had hoppers the entire time. Just gonna, we're just gonna leave that alone. We're gonna forget about that we that we even saw that. Didn't happen. Okay, didn't happen. Oh, it's like growing it. Okay. Correctly. Forward. Except I'll be going there. It's a start. Now let's actually win two. Uh, work in progress. It's a work in progress. Um. Let's see. Way it's a start. I'm gonna need more stone though. We're gonna need more stone, more wood, everything. How are far back? Ooh, everything looks pretty. Look at all that. I'm gonna try doing the band. You know, I don't even think we need to do it that way. I, I want, yeah. No! You make efficient. Way efficient. The fact that I hear and uh, put down. Fan of that. I want which an auto harvest. Auto. So that's why I changed it. Wrong. The so much bamboo at it is cool and all, but yeah. Swing. <laughs> the fact that I gotta chop it lazy is a bit. I see it. If I'm smart enough to figure out a way to harvest, I might as well.
grows quick. Didn't we just chop this down? I'm pretty sure we literally just chopped it down like that. Look, some of it's already like three or All right, now we do it. Okay, let's do this auto thing. It's not perfect. I mean, it does still occasionally get some of the stuff here, but it's not so bad. And it's clearly not working with the bamboo. <laughs> Which means with a different plan for this. So yeah, that's that's pretty much why I started the other thing. Just because I don't want to have to do this thing, I kind of then have. Because let's face it, this is just ridiculous. Now I gotta go in the house. I, th I think we have a lot of bamboo to work with at this point. Honestly, we may have more than we actually need. <laughs> Because I do not have enough stuff to make all the things I wanted to make with the bamboo anyway. Seeds. These are the seeds. I don't... I really need to work better. Sugar cane can go in there. But yeah, we're gonna get rid of all of that bamboo. It's it's all going away. Look at that. Oh, there's someone in here. <laughs> Man, look at all that. Oh, far back. And uh, I am not. I am trying to deal with you guys. Well, they got seventeen carrots in there right now. Oh, well, first we plant what we've got, I suppose. Oh, we are not planting bamboo. No, we are not.
Sugar cane. Start with it. Either way, we're getting to the point where we won't need to do vegetables for a while. I got plenty of cooked food. Huh. I'll grab another sugar cane, bring it up here, and we'll plant it. That should be enough carrots. Yeah, I would think so. Okay. Um This is wheat. We'll do the potatoes first cuz we're already down here. Let's just plant them. I kind of want to play one of the casino games, but we haven't really decided what day is going to be a casino day. I wouldn't mind doing some deal or no deal or something. I've never actually had a real chance to sit down and play that game, I think. I want to. I want to very badly. It's one of the things I've, I don't think I've ever gotten to do. Like, I'm always the one who has to do it for other people, but I've never actually gotten to play it myself, really. I, I might have played it before, but I, yeah, I've never actually gotten to really sit down and concentrate and really try it, you know? So that's something I hope to do at some point during this time, is to actually be able to take part in uh, some stuff. I usually don't get the ability to do that because I was always the admin in the in uh, the realm, and I'm not the admin here, so I'm actually just a regular player. I kind of made sure that that was a a thing automatically, so I I'm not yeah I don't really have any admin related anything at this point, and I kind of like it that way. It also means I have to do everything, like, by, by the book, pretty much, which, I mean, don't get me wrong, is annoying at some points, but I love it. I, 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 well, I wouldn't say love it, but I don't hate it. You know what I mean? Like, there are times it's, it's annoying, but there are times, like, I, I really do like the the grind that it is I think it, it kind of grows on you
Okay, we need you. We might actually have enough seeds this time to uh, plant the entire field. Yep, we did. We did. We, we have an entire wheat thing now. Can't wait till I can start planting nether wart. But I still haven't. I I found uh, we found nether rock, but we did not find soul sand. Or soul soil. I would honestly take either of the two. But I gotta find them first. But yeah, I'm waiting to take down all this bamboo. Like, it, it's gonna go away. I really do not have the space for any of this right now. So, as far as there's another there's another experience thing I'm going to have to build for you guys one of these days. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? What brings you to Minecraft today? I don't need that right now. Okay, let's test this again. Okay, we know that this one... Technically, if we did this one, you'd only get one berry. Because that that's only one berry right there. Okay, so the sugar cane should be working. There should be plenty of sugar cane that made it in there. Hmm. All but two. Okay, so I think I think I only picked up two. Possibly four. Okay. Which means it's not gonna be perfect, but I think it's working out pretty well. I mean, it's not fantastic, and if we let it really grow, I think we'll get more out of it, but we've been testing and looking at it this entire time, so. I think if we just leave it alone for a while, it will grow to be super tall, and that's when we got it. All right. Ah. What to do now? What to do now? What are we looking at here? What are we what are we cooking right now? Tropical fish. I don't think you can cook tropical fish. Let's see if I let's see if I did this right. It's not done yet. Fill up before I can test it that I have. It has to be full.
Oh yeah, not gonna be not gonna work out the way I want to. I'll have to figure out what I what I'm gonna do with these beets and uh, with these carrots and stuff at some point in the near future. I have no idea. Uh, what did I do with my fishing pole? I kind of want to do some fishing. Just kind of hang out here for a little bit. That's not my fishing pole. There's my bow, but where's my fishing pole? It's got to be in one of these, right? There it is. Good old relax. It's still up there. Okay, where? Best thing I could have made right here. No question about it. Again, possible how-to video right here. For one of these things. I, I, I will teach people how to make it. It's not just for you guys, too. It's for me, too. Because, honestly... How to make these things. Like, just to make this one, I literally had to go back to a previous stream that I did, and I would make something remember. Life of me. I had to, like, look. In fact, I didn't even get a solid view of it. Like, I was just like, okay, I saw a, a base of what it looked like, and I was like, okay, well, how does it, how does it work from there? I literally had to guess and put it back together again. So yeah, if I do a how-to video, it's going to be for this too, so I could see how I did it for future reference. We'll check the chest as soon as we get to 22. I don't know what we got, but hopefully we got something good for it. Not as much as I would 
I would like. We got more saddles than I need. I wonder if I can sell saddles to the admin shop. Because technically you gotta find them, right? You can't just you can't just make a saddle. You literally have to find saddles. So like I wonder if I could sell them. You know what? I'll have to ask around about that. I don't know what, what we're going to do for the rules on that one. I know we're not allowed to sell just anything. Uh, because, I mean, there is bunches of stuff I could sell. And make money to get stuff from the casino and whatnot. Bone meal? I could make a ton of bone meal. Enchanting books? I could do those. We'll check it at 23. What would be good is if I can get a good set of netherite armor or something, which I doubt we'll do anytime soon. That's something we're going to have to save up for. Wow, we went out of this for two hours. I'm just trying to waste a little time till I can see officially when we get the bamboo like really high grown. If it'll it'll harvest correctly. That's that's my key thing, is will it harvest correctly? Sugar cane as well. Ooh, we got a book. Uh, protection for flame one. What's this one? 
Luck of the Sea 3, Unbreaking 3, Lure 3, Mending, and then Curse of Vanishing. This is, see, this is what I'm talking about. This is one of those fishing poles that, like, you, you're not going to find this super cheap. Like, if I fixed the, this fishing pole, could I sell it to the admin shop because of how good of a fishing pole that is? Like, that is a really good fishing pole. Like, really good. It just has to be fixed. And I could easily do that. I could easily fix that. Honestly, we don't need this in here. I think this needs to go down here. With these. Let's get some sleep. Wait, is it nighttime? Or is it daytime? It might be daytime. Yep, there he is. Okay. I knew there was a third one. I saw like, and I, then he like disappeared as I turned around. I'm not supposed to be in there. This is what happens when you have a slime spawner in a weird place. Hello, Becca. See how well these things are playing are paying out for us, okay? Look at all of that! Look at that! That is slime right there. That is what this is about. Look at that! Whoo! That is sweet. Alright, alright, alright. What about, what about, what about down here? What about you got? See, now that's what we're talking about. Look at all those arrows. Look at those arrows. Ugh, I'm good. I'm good. I was just working on some auto harvesters. I built a berry auto harvester. A auto harvester. A bamboo harvester and a sugar cane harvester. Ah, dang it. I'm gonna have to replace these. Well, I technically don't have to replace them. I just have to, I guess, well, I guess replace them, but I'm saying replace them would be the way. Gotta be like. Okay. No. Yes. 
That's what we're talking. So roughly how this works here, the Becca, I'm pretty sure you figured it out. Bamboo grows, sugar cane grows, it gets super tall, right? It gets crazy, crazy tall. That's the way it works. It's huge. You're like, oh yeah, it's huge. It's amazing, right? Then this opens up, leaving just the bottom half. Right there. Just that one bottom piece. Right here. Okay? Breaking all of the pieces above. Turning them into whatever those drop. Go here. Boom. They automatically go into this thing where it goes through a bunch of hoppers all the way across and into the house. Down here. To this box right here. And all of the harvesters, all of them, from the sugarcane, the bamboo, the berries, and the cocoa all connect to that box. No. Stupid skeletons. Ugh. Yeah, the thing is, this one and this one, like, all I pretty much came up with yesterday. Off of my head. I was like, I had a conversation with Mike about, I think it was this, and how there was no auto harvester for this, specifically. And I was like, why? I don't know. There's no auto harvester that I know of for Coco. And then, weirdly enough... I guess I was taking a shower, and I always I always get my best ideas when I'm in the shower. So, like, this popped into my head. Like, could I potentially use this to uh, auto? And yeah, yeah, I can uh, I can definitely use a dotto harvest. That's and it it turned out fantastic. We need, what, two more? Huh. Okay. I know I had a huge stack of cocoa beans. Don't know what I did with them. Not a clue. I had a big old stack of them. They're in one of these. I don't... I think I'm going blind or whatever, because I do not see them, though. Cocoa beans. There they are.
All right, that's uh, all I had planned for today was to make all those auto harvesters. Now that I've made them, I don't know what I was supposed to do with the rest of that. Didn't really plan this out. <laughs> Thought those were going to take a little longer than they did. Shows me for planning on something, huh? Let's see. Let's make some more bone meal. No, that's not it. No, that's not it. Bone meal, there it is. Where's the other bone meal? I had one that, uh, another one for bone meal. Ah, that skeleton, that skeleton spawner is amazing. It gives me so many bones to make bone meal with. Totally gonna sell this stuff. If, if, if it's allowed at the, at the admin shop, if it's allowed, I'm totally gonna do it. I'm gonna sell the bone meal. 100%. Because bone meal is like super crazy to get your hands on. Because it's, it's, you need to kill a bunch of skeletons to get it. And since I found the skeleton spawner, and I set it up the way it is, and it's always killing skeletons all the time, so long as I'm here, it literally makes tons of this stuff. Which means I can just keep making bricks and stacks of it and sell it all. It's gonna be glorious. I kind of want to play some deal or no deal. I really do. It kind of sucks. Mike was uh, was on. I'd see if you wanted to wanted to do some casino stuff, but yeah, Mike's not here right now though, so it's not gonna work. Brisby's not here either. But some changes to the casino since we were there. I could probably show that off. Have you seen the casino, Becca? Did we show you the casino? I don't know if you got to see it or not. It's, yeah, I don't know, because we, we've, there have been some changes since we were last there anyway. I haven't, I haven't shown any of those changes on stream yet, but, uh, oh, well, uh, you want to see it? Well, I mean, for what it is, it's not done, but, I mean, we're, we're still technically working on it, but, yeah, like, it's pretty crazy. It's, it is, it's really crazy right now. Uh, let me get rid of some stuff. I really need to, uh, figure out what's happening with all this stuff. I, I do. This is a big mixed match of crazy right here. Gotta put my fishing pole away. Like, there's, there's a lot of stuff here that I, I don't... I don't know what I'm doing with this. Look at all these saddles. What do I have all these saddles for? <laughs> oh, man. So much stuff here that I just... I don't understand why I have it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Eh, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. The rest of it's not not a big deal. Here, I'm not worried about it. Okay, so this is Sky City. We're still working on it. Hey, but yeah, it's called Sky City. Uh, it'll make sense in a second why it's called Sky City. But uh, Brisby... This is all Brisby's work down here, okay? Except for the teleporter things. Uh, but this is this is all Brisby's work. So she did all of this that you see here. Like, it, 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 it gets so much crazier, too. Like, it's so crazy. Um... Let's see. Well, we could do the staircase. Nah, we're not going to do the staircase. We're going to do this. This is the casino lobby where we put the lava slash water fountain right here. Okay, this is kind of our front desk area right here. Uh, we'll start over here. This is our tic-tac-toe right here. There's a brick missing right there. That's not right. We're gonna have to fix that later. This is a little cagey area where people can fight like or whatever. Like you could you can fight different little mobs and people can sit and watch. This is the auction room, so anybody who's playing on the server that like has something they want to auction off, they can come in here and people will you can take and put all your stuff up here that you want to auction off, and then you look this way, right? And anybody who wants to bid pushes one of these buttons. And it rings the bell in front, so you can see which bell rang, and you know who bid. Okay, and that's this part. This is a big place, so we're going to have to take it one, one area. To, there's another brick that's missing. Why is there two bricks missing? That's... Uh... Huh. 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 <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna show you this side next. Okay, so this side, this is this is one of my favorite parts. This, is, this took me a very, this took me like a f several hours to make right here. Like this was a a thing. Like I I yeah I helped build this place. Okay, so like this this is the fish tank or the aquarium for uh, its crown it's called the crown city or sky I, I i think we're calling it crown city i guess i don't know but this is crown's casino okay and it literally says crown it's got the crown right there and then the, the casino part written right here so like in in the fish tank in coral it literally has the crown's casino and you can see it as you're as you're going through like right here. <laughs> the, okay, so in, in here we have the Brisby, uh, it's called the Brisby Seafood Eatery and Bar. I believe we're calling it. <laughs> so yeah, it's like a actual restaurant that you eat at inside 
of the aquarium so you can see all the fish around you at all times. Okay, now we're gonna go into some of these rooms. This was one of Mike's. Well, we'll 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 get those in a little bit because there's other areas we have to go to after that. So, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do one thing at a time here. We did that one, so we'll go this one next. This is fifty fifty. This is uh, I can't remember if you've ever played it or not but it's the odds go up as uh, it goes so you five us, okay and then you pick between one of two boxes and if you pick the box that has five diamonds in it you get back and you get the extra five right but if you pick the other box you get nothing I, we also added in the version of it so you get two times the amount, so instead of getting 10, you would get like 20, and then there's this one, which is the four times amount, which gives you three times the amount of cash, which means you'd get 30 for winning. This is All or Nothing, uh, a game where you start by putting in five diamonds or whatever right you pick between one of two boxes if you pick the one that has the diamonds in it you have the option to walk away or continue and then you can pick between the three boxes and the four boxes and the five and the six but should you fail and pick a box that doesn't have the diamonds you lose everything but if you pick diamonds all the way to the end you get all of it and the number goes up every single time you pick it. And there's a special prize for the first person who can get all the way up to the sixth row, getting all of the diamonds all the way up. This is Checkers, which we have uh, the Checkers over there. Of course, we have deal or no deal, because we always have deal or no deal. You can't, we can't have the casino without deal or no deal. This is the security room right here. This was Mike's idea. I mean, Mike did all of the design for this. So like, yeah, he helped, he pretty much designed that whole deal. <laughs> With the security monitors and everything, like this was all his kind of thing right here. This is the jail. This is where all the offenders who break the rules in the casino go. So yeah, everybody who uh, is a, did a bad. Mm -hmm. Pardon me, big guy. Gotta go out this door. another one that Mike came up with right here this this part right here he thought it would be cool to have like a little kind of garden with bees and stuff fertilizing flowers with like a lookout that goes out this way right here so you could see everything that's going around he was he's he was super psyched about it like he was pretty big about putting this in And 
to the next part. This is chess right here. So we have the chess board with all the pieces and what right here isn't for the game. All the pieces are in these things for each side. This is... Where's the name tag? Chance. Where you can pick between any one of these once you put your money in, for bet down. You can pick between any one of these and you get to keep whatever's in that box. Or you can take what's in the special box, which you get three times the prize of whatever's in this box. But there's a very good chance that it's either nothing or something terrible. This is war. This is a two-player game where both people sit on both sides and you are given 64 pieces of dirt. And you divide it up amongst all of these boxes, and you war against each other. And you make bets as to who you think has the box that has the most in it. And if you can win against the other person more, you win the pot, all or nothing. I'm gonna need you to get out of the way. Cat, thank you. Much appreciated. Okay, this is truth or lies. Random amounts of dirt are put in each one of these boxes based on two people. So both people put random amounts of dirt in each box and they either tell the truth or lie to the other person and say, is in the box. And if you can convince them that your lie, and you say, I agree, that many are in the box, you get a point. Or if you can convince them that you're lying, but you're actually telling the truth, you get a Okay, this is the Lava Lounge. Down spot, where you just kind of get to hang out in the lava. And just, uh, we're walking around in here. There are three running around here somewhere. Usually see them just hobbling around at the lava. That isn't finished. Uh, I don't know. This is something Mike's working on. I don't know totally what's going on with this. <laughs> I don't know. What's going on there at all? <laughs> this is this is not a finished game. Still working on this. This is, uh, and the way this game works is people go. You take a guess how many chickens are going to come out when you push the button at one time and where they're going to come out. So let's take a guess. We'll push the button, and this one's this one's kind of a, an on the house. So you got eight possible holes, starting from one to eight. How many chickens are going to come out when you push the button before the bell rings? Well, that's all you got to do. Take a guess, Becca. How many chickens? How many will, will fall before the bell rings? What is that sound? Sound is. I have no clue. 
You're saying chickens before the bell rings. All right, let's just tell this wind out. Three, three chickens before the bell rang. Not bad, not bad. This lava drop. This is where you take a, you both go through, and you fight each other, and you break the glass. One of you falls into. The glass. There's the replacement glass, so you can fix it. This is one Mike and I are very proud. We put a lot of work into this. Is the slot machines. There are a various variety of items in these. I think there's probably 20 or 30 different items swirling around in here between these two. So you never know what you're going to get when you push the button. For example, let me push the button. What do we get? One iron nugget. We're not going to stuff. They, I got to show you. We're still going. We're still. We're... Is the works just. I helped, uh, I came up with the platform here, and Mike built a fireworks launcher thing. It puts out a fireworks show right there. It like auto refills itself, and then, yeah, it's it it's enough that it could go for like three hours if we if we wanted to. That just is a massive fireworks display. Okay, this is the mob showcase. Where we have pretty much every mob that we can have that doesn't teleport or can be held in one spot. This is uh, the mob showcase. So you got all the different types of zombies right here. We have all the different types of sims. Oh. Uh, all the little, all the netherworld creatures, uh, so like, uh, yeah, all the ones from the nether, from the, uh, geist thing, to the phantoms, to, that, uh, that kill you when you haven't slept. Like, yeah, see, we got everything. E everything. The, uh, these things you get from the end, the, uh, look at the guys that walk in lava, slimes, Magma blocks, ravagers, all of the human bad guys right here. We got spiders right here, creepers, endermites, and of course, silverfish. The noises they make, I'm telling you. Okay, now we gotta go back this way. So much more to do. So let's see. You know, before we go, before we go there, I'm gonna show you the other ones too. So that way, we'll we'll, we'll come back to this one. Okay, if we come in here, you have the zoo of various animals from wolves to to foxes, turtles. Yeah, pretty much most of the animals that exist in the game are here in the zoo.
We even built nice little display things for all of them so that they uh, have like their own little habitats. This is a little art fountain I made called York Falls. This is super deal or no deal. Yeah, it's, uh, pretty much deal or no deal on a massive scale. Instead of being a 1 in 30 chance of getting what you want, you got a 1 in 90 chance. But the prizes are much bigger and much crazier. I know you know this, Becca, because we've played this before. But I'm just saying it for other people, too, you know? Not to mention, we built all of it, so that way there is an awesome view of the aquarium from this whole side. Oop, I went too far down. How did you get in here? Huh. I don't know how that one got in here. Okay, we're not done. There's so much more to do. This is Connect 4. This is one that uh, Mike came up with previously in one of the other... Uh, one of our other ones we did. It was, I think, season three that he came up with this. But yeah, it's Connect 4. It's an actual full-size Connect 4 uh, board. Same thing with the checkerboards and the chessboard. We literally looked at checkerboards and chessboards when we built them. Uh, we're working on several others or ideas for ones right now, like uh, Bingo. We're trying to work out some sort of thing that or roulette we're trying to figure a way to do that one <clears throat> but yeah it's it's all in the works like it's all something we've been working on for a little while okay first we start with this is the Rays of Hope. It's a, a piece of art idea I came up with. With uh, these rays of light coming out of the uh, the water here, shooting into the air. Okay, and over here we have Boat Race. This is a really long, intense boat race that literally goes from the water up and down through lava, like literally through active lava. You can see it right there falling. Like you literally go through it and around it. It's pretty crazy. This is... Honestly, I... I don't know. Like this is like the craziest boat race I've ever... I've ever think... <laughs> you can see come up with. This is the uh, hedge maze right here where there are hidden items throughout the hedge maze hidden in boxes that will be replaced throughout like the time the server's up so like it's going to be like as soon as you go in there you can find objects throughout the maze but you're not allowed to destroy the maze at all I'm not going to go in this one, but, uh, yeah, this one is pretty much, this is the battle zone. Pretty much, this is, I gotta go inside. You come in here, you mark one of these spots, so that way if you die, 
Maker good. Uh, I'm probably gonna die, but let's do it. There are ten chests in this room. Okay. So, each person who has a profile on the server is able to use one of these. Now, watch this. This was not supposed to be here. This is all stuff that was, uh... We don't need that. Those aren't, those aren't supposed to be there. Those are from the... But... <laughs> you can you can you can get in there. It's not impossible. Okay, so each one of these rooms different things spawn here. But yeah, has every type of monster you can fight that doesn't teleport and doesn't die in lava. Or like if it yeah, if they don't die in lava or they can like teleport, they're not in there. And it goes all the way up to warden or or uh so you could withers or an entire warden in there if you want to. And in any one of the rooms, it doesn't matter which room it is, if you kill anything all of this stuff, the loot, will drop automatically all the way to the last room, even, and it'll appear in this chest. And if you look, like, this is a big place, like, this... This is a big building. It just keeps going. It really does. <laughs> but we're not done. There's still more. Over here, we have our horse racing track. Right here. This is so we could... Uh, anybody who really likes horses in the game can have a reason to have them so you can race them here this so yeah that's the horse racing track this is the crowns mall where you have traders of all different types everywhere throughout this place so there's armor traders fishermen it's it's they're everywhere like all the way around Here we have the horse stable, so anybody who has a horse can store them here in this stable, and we can put a name tag as to who owns the horse or the stable specifically. Now we're going to make a long trip back. Okay, we gotta go in... That. that's the wrong room. We gotta go in this room right here. Okay. Ah, uh, let's 
see, first we have... This it is the admin. Nope, this is the bank. This is the bank where everybody has vault in here. The only way to get into this room is through... You cannot get into this room any other way. There is no way to break into it. There's no way to do anything else with it. And an admin will allow people in where each one of these vaults will be labeled as to who they belong to and they will be the ones allowed into here we have the hotel where we'll be given their own there are 10 rooms each of a different color all of them have a in for each whenever somebody gets a uh a room or picks a room and them a bed in each one of these rooms and you will be able to put boxes or whatever the hell, whatever else you feel like in these rooms and set it so you can see here like yeah the public area to use like some of them have great views too like uh, we try to give it a good view each one of them like this is my room right here so you can see all the way out. This was a fun little thing that I needed to come up with some space for. Like there was a bunch of extra little space over here. And I figured why not come up with something for snowball fights? And this was an idea that I got from Mike based on the fact that he was pointing out that when you used to play with him on one of the other servers, you sat there throwing snowballs at him over and over and over again. And I was, that sounds like a fun kind of idea. What if there was a room specifically just for throwing snowballs at each other? So this is snowball fight. I figure it was a fun idea. I didn't. I had a little bit of a space to use, and it works for what we wanted it for. This is the admin shop. Again, the only way into this room is through admin. There is no way in or out of it without admin. So, yeah, like, this is where uh, people are going to go to sell stuff for admin-based things. There's a chest for pretty much every single item in the game you could possibly think of. So, that's there. I believe that is it uh, for now. I don't think we've got anything else in the casino for now. But, uh, yeah, it just keeps getting bigger. So there's probably going to be more in the future. This is the staircase. Brisby was working on this. I This goes all the way back down to... the main area here. And thus, we are back at my house. But yeah, that's uh that's the casino.
Okay, that looks like it'd be a pretty decent test for the bamboo to see if it uh, if it'll work for that. Hmm. We're gonna have to figure out a different way here. Something something that works differently. I mean, I think we're okay. I, I, obviously, I could just hit the button and pick it up the other way if it's necessary. I don't know. I mean, let's face it. It's not the worst it could be, and it still auto-harvests, technically. I just have to walk through it. Am I to understand that we don't have a single space at all in here? I don't. I don't. I don't have a single space in here. Yeah. See, it still it still harvests. I mean, it does the. the it's fine. It'll be fine. I mean, it's not perfect, but it, it'll work. It's It'll work for what we got it for. Okay. So, with that said, people, it has been a bit. It's been like... Three hours now. I think we're good. I think we're gonna get off. But we did manage to do exactly what I wanted to do when I came in, which was I wanted to build those auto spawners, or those auto harvesters for the bamboo, the sugarcane, the glow berries, and uh, the cocoa, which is that was my whole goal for this entire stream, and we did do that. So I mean, we're good. Which again, I will probably build all of this stuff over again in my how-to streams, which I think I'm gonna do at some point in the near future. So, for those who watched, thanks for watching. And I hope to see you next time.